In this video, we'll cover how to edit page properties like backgrounds, sketch effects, and guides. The Page Properties pane is below the wireframe. In the Page Formatting tab, you can open the Page Style Editor dialog to set up styles to use across pages, or you can edit properties for just the current page. Page Align allows you to left align or center align the page to your browser. This only applies to the HTML, so you won't see the change in the wireframe. Back color applies a background color to the page. Back image lets you import an image to use for the background. Horizontal alignment and vertical alignment sets the alignment of the background image. And repeat tiles the image horizontally, vertically, or both. On the right side of the page formatting tab is the sketch effects, which you can use to apply a hand-drawn look to your wireframe. Use the sketchiness slider to set the sketchiness of the lines. You can switch your wireframes from color to grayscale, and apply a uniform font across all the widgets on the page. Then increase the line width if you want to emphasize the hand-drawn look. I'm going to set this back to the defaults before showing you page styles. Click on the icon to the right of the dropdown to open the page style editor. We're going to edit the default page style for all the pages in the file. You can also create custom page styles. You'll see the created styles in the page style dropdown. Choosing a style applies those properties to the page. Now let's take a look at creating guides to help with layout and aligning widgets. Guides can either be on a specific page or they can be global and apply to all the pages in your file. To add a guide to the current page, drag from the horizontal or vertical ruler and drop it onto the wireframe. You can drag and drop the guides to reposition them. Guides are green when selected and page guides are blue when not selected. To add a global guide for all the pages, hold down the control key if you're on a PC and the command key if you're on a Mac while dragging from the ruler. Global guides are pink when not selected. To hide and lock the guides, right click on the wireframe, choose grid and guides, and select an option. You can also create guides using the create guides dialog. There are a couple presets available based on the 960 grid system. You can choose from 12 column or 16 column, or specify your own layout. Check create as global guides if you'd like the guides to be on all the pages. That's the end of the page properties demo. If you have questions, email us at support at or tweet us at ActureRP.